Good, beautiful morning guys, how are you doing today? Hopefully in fresh weather, beautiful and another fine and fantastic day again today. Welcome to Holly's car. We are in my new car. You're not driving it. I'm though. not driving it, no. Look at this, it's blue on the inside. I was gonna say, I don't feel like we showed it off very well the other day. I was a bit stressed the other day, I'm gonna, I'm gonna say. I don't like driving and my cousin lives quite a long way away, so it was a long drive, which involved very narrow lanes and motorways. <laughs> so I kind of uh, felt like uh, <laughs> I didn't want to show Holly's And I was very really stressed levels. and I didn't really want to be on camera, which then made it quite hard to, you know, film the car I was sat in. <laughs> <laughs> and we obviously didn't drive back together and only had one camera. So yeah. it wasn't the easiest situation to film. So again, new car. <laughs> which, which I am now being the, the chauffeur. Yeah, basically, I bought a new car so James could drive it for me. <laughs> I didn't really because have a I can't afford to buy a car that drives itself yet, so I bought a new car for James to drive me around in. <laughs> 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 just like, okay. I was not expecting to around to see the camera right in my face then. I'm still absolutely loving the. What a loud vehicle. So, absolutely loving the key though, Lovely. Zebra. Look at that, Holly. How was it? Your first experience of being the passenger in your own car? You did very well, thank you very much. Thank you very much. I only stalled it once, this one. which makes Holly feel a lot better so about now herself. We're even. I stalled it once. It's because that yeah, car now has one of those start stop features, so when you stop a traffic light, the engine cuts off. And I kind of forgot about this whole situation and everything went to pull away, and you know, it went to start, but I was going to start it, and it was all a bit of a kerfuffle. But don't worry about Holly, if you stall, we all stole. All right? Does that make we you feel better? It does. It genuinely does. So me and Holly just had a conversation <laughs> about stall and install. The word stall. The word stall. You basically you can you can have a stall like a shop a stall. You can sit down on a stall. Are we just saying it wrong? You can install something. You can stall someone, and you can or is it just do a stall. Where they all, all these different words? Are they all the same? same? This is like two dyslexic people trying to work out one word here. Is it just the stupid English language that stool has literally like five different meanings? I've never thought of it before. <laughs> anyway, moving on. We have just arrived to Cabot, to Cabot Circus, in Cabot Circus. My brain's not working yet, Holly. No. We need to get a coffee. It is like, it's later on in the day as well, actually. We didn't pick up the camera until like three o'clock this afternoon. We haven't even explained, Holly. Done. Holly got a haircut Wait, today. Like you can't really see, but she's had kind of pink like put in it. It is like unicorn like colour hair. I'm loving it, Holly. <laughs> You've done very well. Well, the hairdresser did well. You've had I to just sit there. still yeah. for about three hours. Yeah. Thank you very much. find that when we come into Lush, everything literally looks so edible. It's like a milk bowl. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that one smells. That one? No, you're not allowed to eat them. <laughs> I mean, just look how good these look. I just want to eat them. We're not in the child section, but this hat looks way too small for a normal human being. Come here, Holly. I don't have a massive look. head. It, it, Is that what it's for, though, to just crop? Maybe that's like the new fashion. So this is the uh, the new fashion, only £12, got a couple of holes in and oh my god! <laughs> do you have to, do you have to dislodge your arm to wear, is this the new fashion trend? Break your arm? Yep, I like it, I'll take three of them please. <laughs> so one of the main reasons why we wanted to come to Bristol as well today is because I want to go to the Apple store because I feel like there's something wrong with my phone and the thing is, is when I turn the camera on on my phone it fizzes like there's an electrical issue with it and then the screen like I'll just show you you see my camera yeah my camera does this really weird thing where it's like I'm underwater it's just it glitches and it's all like wavy and stuff I don't think it's normal so how long has it been Holly too long is it really long, yeah. it's been like what a couple of weeks yeah this is the main reason we can't rest it really I think everyone can probably guess what is gonna happen right now and that is 
Dun dun dun. So obviously, as you know, we absolutely love our wagon members, and I'm going through the menu right now trying to choose something which I haven't had before. And I always get this word mixed up. I always just find it funny. A shiitake. Yeah. Shiitake? Yeah. This, this word. It's, it's spelled shit tank, basically. And I find it hilarious, but I'm actually going to go for it. The shiitake donburi, which is shiitake. So please don't order a shit tape, don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> what are you going to go for, Holly? Uh, a samla curry. A samla curry. I've had it <laughs> And look at this bowl of goodness I've got here, which is basically mushroom omelette with broccoli, carrots, on rice, with teriyaki sauce, and bean shoots? Pea shoots. Pea shoots. And I've got your chilli. They did have chilies on it, which were flipping hot. And I'm just having a little bit of noodles. Because yours hadn't arrived yet. And there it is. What have you gone for, Holly? Sandler curry. What? Ooh! Wagamama never fails. How was that for you, Holly? That was uh, everything I ever wanted ever. <laughs> Basically. You should have seen it when Holly piled on her rice, then she piled on her dipping noodles. I was so hungry. I didn't. I had a very lame lunch, so that was, that was perfect. <laughs> I don't think we actually had a full conversation through that whole meal. We no, both we literally just chowed right down. We just ate and didn't even look at each other. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't joking when I said it at this video. Come on. I bought this car for you to drive me. You just need to drive a little bit home. Yeah. Then you can you can pull over and then I'll drive the rest of the way. Start the journey. No, <laughs> your key, your car, you you take it for a spin. Come on, come on. I'm not a cat. <laughs> come on, Holly. <laughs> come on, Holly. It does kind of baffle me that you don't want to drive your own car. I do. I just don't want to drive through Bristol city centre. <laughs> Like, if I had a brand new car, I would be wanting to drive it all the time. And Holly's just like, mm -hmm, you can drive, you can yeah, drive, you can drive. Bristol city centre. It's like seven o'clock, it's not rush hour. Yeah, but it's Bristol, it's, it's chocker at four in the morning. <laughs> okay. okay. You can drive the new car. You said you've got a new car and you want to drive it, so you go right I, I don't have much choice, Holly. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, oh my God, look at it. It's look at the absolutely chaos. absolutely crazy <laughs> rush hours. Oh my gosh, Holly! I know! Oh my god, there's a bus! And there's, there's, there's actually there is actually some traffic. Can you guys believe that the other day I had a comment, <laughs> I can't even remember who from, and someone said that they loathe the console tower. Loathe. Loathe. I haven't heard that word in a very, very long time. And I just questioned myself, why do you loathe it? What's wrong? Do they mean it in the sense of like, I really, really, really I was, hate it? I was thinking, I wonder if they meant to put love. I love the I console think that's tower. that's probably what they meant. Because, you know, who can loathe fun, right? That's just the tower of I fun. I know, like, admittedly, there is a few wires in there at Maybe the moment. Because the they haven't wired them all in. Maybe that's the reason why they loathe it. I'm going to go But loathe. loathe. I think loathe is I a little bit that's overkill. Type. They definitely meant love. They meant love. They love the tower. Because who doesn't love the console tower? Come on. So it was probably about a year ago, me and Holly always used to have an, an amazing breakfast. We used to make it the night before, it was like overnight oats, and we literally haven't had it for probably a year, since like summer last year. And I've now decided to uh, destroy the kitchen just a little bit <laughs> and make some overnight oats. We've got like, we've got porridge oats, we've got like a muesli mix, We've got yogurt, we've got, I'm not going to pick it all up because it's all a bit minging, but like apples, oranges, we've got donut peaches and stuff, a little bit of apple juice all mixed in together into a bowl, then you put it over like, put cling film over it, put it in the fridge and then eat it in the morning. It is like so flipping good. I'm actually very excited about this because we actually bought this stuff a good couple of days ago and every night we always forget to make it because that's the thing when you're making breakfast for the next day, you kind of don't think it because breakfast is like a morning thing. So this evening when I got back, I thought, you know what, I'm just gonna make it because I know I'm gonna thank myself in the morning. And there it is, all that goodness in a bowl, chuck that in the fridge, and then it's all nice and ready and waiting for the morning. And what are you guys saying about my brand new office and gaming chair? It's pretty damn flipping awesome. The main thing, what I think is flipping good, 
is how well it fits into the room. Having white, black and grey as a chair just fits the room and I think it looks flipping awesome. And little reminder now, if you haven't seen the previous video which I've uploaded, I talk about this chair and also I'm running a competition and one of you guys can win this chair. We're not not this exact chair because this is this is my chair and I'm sat on it and stuff. I'm running a competition over on that video so if you haven't seen it go over and check it out. It's the previous video I will put a link in the top line of the description you can go over and check it out and just enter and have a chance of winning one of these bad boys. And with all that being said I'm just going to end today's video. Thank you so much for coming on today's round little fun adventure with both me and Holly. If you've enjoyed it please smash a big fat thumbs up and I will see you next time in the next video, remember those three very important things, which are, as always, stay happy, stay positive, stay awesome. Goodbye. The colours look great and it is very comfortable. The most interesting part of the video, you've probably been waiting for like the whole time of this video to actually get to this part, and that is the competition. One of you guys can win one of these gaming office chairs very, very soon. And all you have to do is click the link in the description 